What's up, YouTube friends, family, associates, and subscribers? I wanted to know, am I the only one that seen this right here? This is a movie that's coming out. And that's the title of it right there. Let's go ahead and play it. All right, boys, lock and load. So what are we dealing with here? Gun runners, gun dealers. It's this two was... women who are counterfeiting coupons. Crazy, right? Oh my God. This feels like a lot. You don't think we're coming in a little hot here, boss? Total is one thirty-eight fifty-five cents. Is it? It's like a, a true thousand story. coupons. Your trophy. Yo, yo, yo! It's time to save a JoJo. Is it hot in here, or is it just me? They've been watching you. some of y'all Facebook groups, not mine. We have a mountain. Is this, is this the best we're ever gonna do? How come I'm so broke? The system has set us up to fail. You know who gets rewarded? People who don't follow the rules. It's time we start bending them a little. Oh my! Where did you get these? God. Listen. When you send these companies a complaint, we send you a coupon for free stuff. All of these free coupons come from one factory. It's like Robin Hood. We gotta steal these coupons and sell them to families who really need them. That's money in the bank. Shameful. Dirty. Oh, baby, I got your money. Don't you worry. I say hey. I am the loss prevention officer. Thousands of these coupons are getting mailed out all over the country. Crazy. On the ground ASAP. Oh, Based on a true story. You started. heard him. He said that they were sending the FBI. What do you do? You carry mail around or something? That would be a mailman. They carry the mail. I carry a gun. We are investigating a counterfeit coupon ring, costing companies tens of millions of dollars. We need someone who's had experience with this sort of thing. We've got to spread this shit out. I'm talking bank accounts, credit cards, a stash house, and aliases. Could you say it all again and like much slower? Like a full and do like time pad just to write illegal it career. No, get out. Okay, we don't wing it, but we got it. We got it. You gotta let me in on this thing. Who's the girl, Earl? I think it's pretty clear that Earl doesn't know. Him. Call a sketch artist. Call a sketch artist? <laughs> yeah, like, who do you think she is? Kaiser Soze? <laughs> Queen pins. Coupons aren't about what you buy. It's about the feeling you get. They call it the coupon high. Supposedly it's better than intimacy with another person. Or so I've been told. Sorry, I, have you not used a coupon or have you not had sex? What happened? The website is way too easy to trace back to you. Is there anything else I should know about? I don't think so. No. Well, yo, 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 it's time to say with JoJo. I mean, how could they trace it? Get back to you. Who they been watching? Which one of y'all they been watching? Man. Y'all better be careful out here in these coupon streets. Oh, my gosh. I just wanted y'all to see that. That is insane, right? And, I, of course, we all knew this was going on. Like, we know it's people that's making fake coupons because the stores are giving us a hard time when we come in with the real coupons because of people like this coming in making their own coupons. I don't know how they're doing it. I'm assuming they're getting the barcodes um, off of the real coupons and somehow pasting them or printing them on fake coupons. It said it's based off a true story. Um, is it already out yet? Yeah. Wow, he's the one showed me this and told me about it. I did not know about this movie. I hope it's better than the Karen movie because that just wasn't long enough for me and I just needed some more info or some more good parts in that movie, the Karen movie. But um, this looked like it's going to be hilarious. It does kind of look like a comedy too. <laughs> That's why I was laughing, but it's based off a true story. Y'all know the feds be in these Facebook groups and on. Thank you, Sienna. Thank you, Jackie. Both of your comments just popped up for my last video that I just uploaded. Um, but yeah, that's that's insane. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this new movie and will y'all be watching? I know I will. Y'all know I watch new, old, and unreleased movies right here from my laptop. So if it's um or he just he just said it's out so i'm about to try to look it up and find it now on um oh, i want to release that because last time i 
upload it to tell y'all where to um find free movies like the site is gone now so um yeah i'm about to check this out i'll let y'all know in the comments somewhere if i eventually watch it rather it's today next week or whenever and tell you how it was so um yeah that's crazy they made a freaking career out of this like a garage and then it looked like a whole nother house with computers and stuff so it won't trace back to them so of course they knew it was illegal because they're trying to find out ways where it won't trace back to their ip address where they are printing the coupons and then talking about selling them to um families to help them save struggling families or whatever they said and a lot of people know their fake coupons, the struggling families that are buying them. I'm not trying to go to jail about no coupon. I don't care. Okay? I don't care if it saved me $50. That's insane. If a coupon looks too good to be true, nine times out of ten it is. Now, we get a lot of free stuff with legal coupons. Why get greedy and try to get a fake coupon if a pack of Huggies is $12? The coupon should not say $10 off. That's insane. The most they will give you is like $4 off. And then with other savings, you can get them almost free if you do it right. Instant savings and at CVS CRTs or Walgreens cash on top of the $4 off coupons and points and all that. That's how we get the stuff free legally. Don't go out here and be in a coupon dealer in these coupon streets and get busted with these fake coupons. All right, y'all, I'm gone. That's quite enough. That'll be quite enough. I will see y'all on the next video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Please give the video a thumbs up, meaning like it. If you dislike it, hell, give it a thumbs down. Just give me some type of feedback to let me know how I am doing. Please tell a friend to tell a friend about Shade with the receipts. And please share, share, share if you dare, honey. And I hope y'all have a wonderful night. Toodles. Oh, this is what I meant to add, you guys. Um, The part where they said that you can email the company's um complaints and they'll send you free coupons you don't have to email the company's complaints you can email the companies um how much you love their products and everything some of them may tell you that they don't send out coupons um but a lot of them will send you coupons anyway whatever products you like they always have a phone number on the back and if you can't find an email or another way to contact them just google it I used to do it all the time. I've emailed um, PNG and they've sent me game coupons. They're not going to be the ones like in the paper. It's going to be specifically for you and it will have your name on it or whatever name you put in the email. So you do not just have to complain to these companies. That's horrible. If you don't have a legitimate complaint, don't do that. If you love their products, tell these companies you love their products. As a matter of fact, I'm about to um, Google Unilever's email and um, ask for some coupons because I want some suave coupons and I do use their products um, faithfully on myself and my daughter's hair, the suave naturals. Okay, that's all I had to say, y'all. Toodles.